as you're thinking about an exit strategy, some of it is, you know, ultimately what, and it's not just about the money, it's what is the contribution you would like this company to make in the world? What is the, the end result, for example, in the terms of uh, the transformation? And, and it may be numbers of people that you've affected, but also how it has helped an economy or your particular target market what people have gained or learned when you think about the end result of working with you and multiply that by a thousand or a hundred thousand. What does that look like in the world? Uh, and then being able to, to work backwards from that to say, well, to achieve that result, I need to have a hundred thousand clients and these may be the price points at which I charge. Um, but so if you're able to reverse engineer it, then you're able to see today, what do you need to build toward and what are the systems that need to be in place to pull gradually pull you out of the dependency equation. I don't want to say that money should not be part of the equation. That is very important. So as you, as you think about the lifestyle you have or you want to lead, there too, you're going to need to do some money calculations to think about what is it that you will truly need if you say, all right, fine, I'm going to cash out, or what do I want to be able to generate along the line? But it's not the only consideration, and very often it's not enough to keep us passionate about wanting to, to stay on this journey.